Apple's being forced to take L after L, all thanks to the EU. This latest one is reversing a policy Apple's had for ages. They've now updated their App Store policy to officially allow retro game emulators, not just in the EU, but worldwide. And it's not just the emulators that are allowed, but you'll also be able to download games in the emulator apps as long as they're not pirated titles. For years, if you wanted to emulate ancient consoles like the 3DS, you'd either have to jailbreak your iPhone or or you'd simply have to be using Android. But after a $2 billion settlement against Apple and forcing them to comply with their Digital Markets Act, the EU has gotten Apple to change their stance. On top of all that, Apple now allows music apps like Spotify to include links that take you to a website so you don't have to subscribe directly in the app, which is often more expensive. And let's also remember that it was the EU that finally got Apple to adopt USB-C as well.